Hey guys, NES Evolution here. Doing a like retro unboxing today. Um, so I have this uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie number three, uh, Princess, Princess Mitsu. And I have this turtle figure from, when is it from? 90, 92? So yeah, um, as you see, the box is in pretty bad shape. I mean, it's not sealed by any means, so that's why I am opening it. Um, and it's got a huge rip right here. So it's not like it's in mint shape or anything. You see it has the turtles back there. It's got other figures in the line. Uh, the weapons that she comes with. She comes with a accessory close-up. Uh, quick set. Quiver, ready, aim, twang, it says. Time slip and scepter, the key to the power in the 16th century. Bodacious bow and arrow, because a bow by itself is no good, and an arrow is too hard to throw. <laughs> Broadsword dagger, it's broad, it's a sword, it's short, so it's a dagger. Simple, isn't it? Uh, heroin, deer horn knife every princess has one okay uh and i always remember these on the back of the packages the pizza slices you can save them up uh redeem people pizza points for saving on exclusive turtle memorabilia but i never did it so i don't know why but it has like a bunch of stuff about her right there so yeah um now okay by far and away this is uh, out of the original three this is the worst um movie um, there is, um, yeah, by these figures, I have almost all of them, uh, that are back here on the box. Um, but yeah, so let's open this. This is crazy. This is from 92, man. Um, yeah, let's unbox it. I got it. I don't remember why I got it, but I got it really cheap. Um, okay, all of her accessories are here, but let's look at Princess... Um, yeah, there goes the box. And no, I am not keeping the box and throwing away. This is Princess, um, Mishtu. Right here. You know, it's an early 90s turtle figure. So the articulation, you know, um, the arms move. There's no elbow movement or anything. The head does move back and forth. Ponytail. Really good, um... I like this. I always wondered why they put this kind of an angle on a foot of a figure. Like, what is the point of that? I mean, this is good. This, like, I, I, I don't understand that. Okay, so let's get down to her accessories. Um, we got the, the time travel thing there. I threw the thing away. <laughs> so I don't know what it says. Oh, here's the deer hunter knife. There that is. We got... Oh, well, that'll... Oh, sh... I always drop something, don't I? Crap. Here's the quiver with the arrows. Here is the dagger, broadsword dagger. <laughs> Um, and here's a strap for the quiver right here. And well, you know what happened to the bow and arrow here? So let's try to get it. Hang on. I have to stand up. Ah. Uh. Here's the bow and arrow. <laughs> okay, so she doesn't really have a holding hand. I mean, she does kind of. That's how she can hold her bow. Like, you can't hold it any other way. Like, yeah, she can't really hold anything. Oh, I see. Not meant to hold her bow and arrow, I don't think. I think she's meant to hold this. 
The knife fits nicely, as you can see there. Um, the dagger. The other hand, like, you can't put anything in it. The dagger does go nicely in the hand, too. Um, but yeah, like I said, the other hand is just, like, closed, dude. So, I'm gonna go ahead and assemble this real quick. Okay. Well, can't hand this. So yeah, um, I actually have one more classic turtle that I'm gonna unbox that the box isn't in very good shape. So why? Well, actually, two. One is a rare figure, but I'm gonna unbox it anyway because the simple fact is the box pretty much shot. So. Yeah, let's do this and see how this goes. Yep. Okay. So that's the... That's how that goes, I think. I might... Can go underneath her. Yep. And then maybe... You can kind of put the bow and arrow in there, too. I guess you could do that. Could put the bow and arrow through there as well so yeah this is this is pretty cool um yep i like the figure like i said i do have a collection of them maybe i'll show them all in an overview um but yeah she doesn't really hold on to the bow and arrow very well they didn't make her hands well for that um if she wants to travel through time She's got this. So yeah, pretty cool. Overall review, not a bad figure. I mean, not, you know, nothing I would have been interested in when I was a kid, to tell you the truth. Oh, you know, I just noticed she does have arm swivel here um, at, the, at the elbow. So that's cool. So I guess you could hold her bow like that. So that makes more sense. There you go. Like that. So, okay, guys, that is my review and look at Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie figure. Um, gosh, what was the name? Musto? Misto? I don't remember what it was. Okay, guys. See ya.